Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Shelby, and today's video is going to be a Q&A. So pretty much I'm just going to be answering all the questions that you have been asking me recently. So let's just get right into this. So I did write down a few questions that you guys have been asking me for a while now, and then I did write down the questions that you guys asked me in a video where I asked you to ask me questions. You know what I mean? <laughs> So the first question is, why did you start YouTube and when did you start YouTube? So long story short, I started just because I love makeup. Like makeup has always been a really big passion of mine. I think I started wearing makeup when I was probably like 10, 11, 12 maybe. I'm not really sure if I go back in pictures, like I always had some sort of makeup on. It's a little crazy. I wasn't that good either. Like it was, it was bad. And I was really bad at color matching too. But besides that, um, I pretty much just started because my cousins actually like mentioned it to me because I was always watching YouTube videos. They were like, why don't you just start your own channel? Like you're constantly on it. Like why don't you just start your own channel? And I was like, what? I was like, no, like, no. And then here I am. <laughs> I ended up starting about five months after they mentioned it to me because I definitely had to get some lights, equipment, you know, get the courage up to like get the first video up, which was very, very cringe worthy of watching now. I think my first video was in March of 2017. So I've been doing this a little bit over a year. I'm honestly really happy with just my YouTube channel in general and YouTube in general. I just love doing it. I love sitting here talking to you guys just about like the one thing that truly makes me happy and it's makeup. I love testing out new products for you guys. I love when you guys comment and you just notice something different. And I don't know. I just love it. I just love the whole atmosphere. It's totally different. So that's why I did and that's when I did. The next question is what college are you attending and what is your major? I've gone to quite a few colleges. Um, I've gone to a community college here in my city and then I went to University at Buffalo for one semester. I ended up not really liking it. Didn't really like being away from my family because I'm very family oriented. Like I love hanging out with my family. which is a big thing. Um, and I just didn't really like it. Like I didn't feel like I was going anywhere while I was at UB. So then I transferred back to Oswego. That's where I originally started. And that's where I am now and where I will be graduating. So like I started there and I'm ending there. Just took a little bit in between, you know what I mean? But um, yeah, and my major is business administration and then my minor is economics. So your girl's gonna get a business degree. And I did mention to you guys that I wanted to do or go for cosmetology after I graduated. And one of the questions was, are you still considering attending cosmetology school later on? And this is a tough one. I really want to have my license like in cosmetology, not just like hair. Like I just want it for like the face, makeup portion, facials, you know what I mean? I don't know what that's specifically called. If you know what that's called, let me know down below. But um... I really still do want to do that because I think it would be nice to have a license and be able to do other people's makeup knowing I have a license, but I don't know. I guess I'm just kind of going to play it by ear because that is like more money. And then I plan on getting like a full-time job after I graduate and then like I still want to do YouTube of course, so that's pretty much like two full-time jobs and then adding cosmetology school like at nights onto that is gonna be tough but I don't know I'm just gonna like play it by ear the next question is who inspired you in the beauty community um my main inspiration has to be Casey Holmes like I have been obsessed with her forever I just feel like I can relate to her on like another level a lot of people say that I look like her I act like her but like I'm my own person, but I definitely do get a lot of inspiration from her. And she just is the one that kind of like I can relate to the most, especially with makeup, skin, the whole shebang. I just like her style. She doesn't live in LA like most YouTubers, which is nothing wrong with that. I think that's amazing. But she lives in New York now. Hey, 
But she's just like a, such a homebody. She loves her dog. She loves her husband. She loves YouTube. But she's hustling on the other side with owning her own company. Like, she just does exactly what I want to do when I'm older. So I kind of like, I'm just like, oh goals right there. So she definitely has inspired me the most. There's other people of course but she's like number one. And moving on to YouTubers, the next question is who are your favorite YouTubers? Uh, Casey Holmes. Um, I really like watching Buff Bunny and Christian Guzman just because they're more fitness vlogs. I think they're really entertaining. I learn a lot especially because I'm starting to get really into fitness. Um, what else? Love Shawnee Grimmond. Nazanin Kavari. Love her. So down to earth. Oh my goodness. They're just like my top ones. I definitely have like a ton more people. Like if you just scroll, there's so many people I'm subscribed to. But I just watch random ones too. The next question is, what do you use to get your hair straight and shiny when you straighten it? So pretty much I just use a heat protectant, like an argon oil spray, and a leave-in conditioner. Straighten it and it ends up like this like I don't have any secret tips but I make sure to always use heat protectant because that's how my hair grows so fast and is so like silky smooth and there's not a lot of dead ends I mean of course I got some dead ends the next question is how did you and your boyfriend meet <laughs> we actually met on tinder I'm not gonna lie I'm not ashamed like, it actually worked. Apparently, we both were avid users of Tinder. It was just like a random night. We were both really bored. So I just went on Tinder because that was the last app I had to go on my phone because I already went through all of the other ones. And I just, like, kept swiping. I was like, eh, 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 eh. And then I saw him, and I was like, ooh. Ooh. Muscles. Tall. Handsome. Yeah. He did the same thing, and then we just started talking, and then we went on a date, I think, like, five days later, and ever since that, it's history. Next question is, when do you plan on getting married, and do you want kids? Marriage, not for a very long time. Um, I'm still very young. He's definitely not ready. I'm definitely not ready. Like, we've talked about it, and, like, we've discussed it, but it's not something, like, we want right now. I definitely want to finish college get a job, be stable, he wants to do the same thing, like, just not right now, too soon, definitely too soon, like, I would just like to, like, I don't know, live our lives, not worry about marriage for right now, just, just be happy, we're really happy where we are right now, like, we are good, we're good. And then do I want kids? Yes, of course, but not for a very long time. Um, I'm definitely thinking, like, six, seven, eight years down the line, I'm 20 turning 21 in like two months but yeah not ready yet like I don't and to be honest babies kind of scare me right now so and then do you have another job other than YouTube no I do not right now um during this semester I just kind of took it off um it was really stressful it was really nice to have a break but definitely am going to be getting another job during the summer what nail polish are you wearing Oh, I'm so sorry guys. Like, I honestly have no idea what nail color this is. It's a gel. Uh, I don't know. 542 at my nail salon. That's it. I don't know. It's like a pink coral with a little bit of, like, orange in it. It depends on, like, what lighting you're in. It could be really orange or really pink. So, I don't know. I'm sorry. And then the next question is, do you play or watch any sports? I do not play any sports right now. Um, my main thing is beauty, and I like to go to the gym and do my workouts through there, not like playing sports. I'm not really a sports type of player. I do like watching sports. I like watching football the most. Football is like the most entertaining and interesting to me. And then it would have to be basketball. Um, baseball is fun to watch, except it gets a little boring after a while. Um, if you could only have one makeup item to wear, what would it be? Mascara. Where would your dream destination be? Wow. I've never thought about this one. Um, Bora Bora. Anywhere tropical that is gorgeous. Honestly, like, I would love to travel the world, like, go to every country. And then, what is your favorite genre of movies and music? Probably comedy, romance, and action. 
action is definitely up there. And then music would have to be, oh my goodness, everything. Rap, hip hop, country. The last question is, do you have anything planned for your 21st birthday? So I am turning 21 finally. I know, it feels like forever. July 4th. So Matt and I do have plans. We are actually going to visit Boston. We've never been to Boston. I love going to cities like that. I've been in New York City a lot, honestly. So I was thinking, let's go somewhere different that's not too far away. I hope you guys really enjoyed this Q&A. If you have any more questions for me or if you're curious about anything, just let me know down below and I'll answer them sooner than later. And definitely hit that subscribe button before you leave. We're so close to 5K. Ooh, my goal is to hit 5K before my birthday. So yeah, give this video a like if you like this Q&A, and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye loves.